It's a matter of pride for Indians. India was handed over the presidency of G20. India will officially assume G20 presidency from 1st December for one year. The country will organize G20 meetings in different cities and states. Indonesian President Joko Widodo handed over the gavel of the presidency to PM Modi amid a round of applause at the closing ceremony of the Bali summit. The two-day bloc leader summit in Bali came to a close on Wednesday. The G20 comprises 19 countries. Together, they account for over 80% of the global GDP and two-thirds of the world population. PM Modi said that India's G20 presidency will be inclusive, ambitious, decisive and action-oriented. India is taking the charge at a time when the world is grappling with geopolitical tensions, economic slowdown and rising food and energy prices. Chinese President Xi Jinping, US President Joe Biden, UK Prime Minister Rishi Sunak and French President Emmanuel Macron were among others who attended the summit. Digital issues and reforms of multilateral financial institutions are among the focus areas of India's G20 presidency. PM Modi urged other G20 leaders to pledge that they will work together for digital inclusion over the next decade. During its G20 presidency in 2023, India will work jointly with partners in the grouping of the world's 20 largest economies to achieve this objective.